It is already a year off schedule. Now the nightmare continues for the ART project. Mayor Tim Keller announced today the buses are not safe to be on the streets, so the project is on hold again. News 13's Rebecca Adkins is live at the ART station along Central near Rio Grande with the latest. Rebecca. Well, Kim, the latest developments are alarming from doors opening on their own to faulty brakes. And Mayor Tim Keller says these buses aren't safe for the drivers or the public. <laughs> Nearly a year after former Albuquerque Mayor Richard Berry launched the first ART bus ride, there are no cheers coming from Mayor Tim Keller's office. These buses right now appear to be unsafe at any speed. Today, Keller released the bad news that the ART buses, which were expected to launch this winter, are unsafe to be on the roads. We are actually grounding the fleet uh, until we do a full inspection of every single bus, and this is due to safety reasons. Earlier this year, the city fixed construction issues and design flaws with the ART stations, but in September, when they kicked off driver training, the city found major mechanical malfunctions with the buses. Bolts began to fall off doors, and rear doors would open during bus operation without any action by the driver. And if that's not alarming enough, the city's transit director, Bernie Toon, says the most serious concern is due to faulty brakes. This is a fleet-wide issue and poses significant safety concerns that have to be resolved by BYD before any city employee or member of the public rides on these buses. Keller says he's losing his patience with the Chinese bus company BYD. And if they can't fix the problems, they're looking at three other options. One being an entirely new fleet of buses, a mixed fleet bringing in some buses from another city, or not having electric buses run at all. I am not going to let our city and our taxpayers be taken advantage of by a company or put our citizens at risk uh, with these issues on the buses. So far, the city has 15 ART buses. There are four more that have yet to be delivered, but the city says they will not accept them until these issues are resolved. As for a start date for the ART project, Mayor Keller says he hopes to have a better idea of a timeline in about a month. Kim, back to you. Okay, thanks, Rebecca. Now, we have reached out to the firm representing the bus company about the issues. We're told they will release a statement later today.